Hello everybody, this is Everforth Cromwell coming to you live. Well, not really live, but you know what I mean. So today I'm playing a game called Code Combat, in which you move your character through various worlds slash levels. And in order to move it, you have to code how you want to move them. So let's start with Kithgar Dungeon. It's one to three hours. It teaches you syntax, methods, parameters, strings, loops, and variables. Let's roll. Right, and now we are going to play this first level here. More battle scars! This is Captain Anya Weston, and he is a no-nonsense leader who isn't afraid to go in and get the job done, whether it's defending a village, raiding an ogre base, or picking up shiny things. We're not gonna be here. Nothing to it. We're right, gonna be Sir Thorin Thunderfish. A mighty warrior Thorn knows just three things. Exploring building stuff, and combat. He's tough, but slow. Yeah, we'll be him. We'll use Python to default. We'll equip that. And then we'll press play. <coughs> no combat. Pardon these noises. My ear tickles. So we're gonna start level. Not a problem. Grab the treasure. Uh -huh. So we have to grab the treasure. You can use these methods. This is this here tells you where Type the your code, code is. on the right. So we'll do self dot move down, self dot move right. We'll press run. Oh what? Self dot move whoopsie. We'll run that. I what is going on here? What? I'm confused. Oh, so I have a confession to make. I played the first three levels before, so I do you know a little bit of what's going on here. But that has never happened to me before. That was so weird. Okay, so level complete. Victory. Oh, completed level one. Oh, wait. Completed one level, I'm sorry, not completed level one. Um, so I've earned 5 XP from... Well, I did have a code error, though. Whatever. I have from completing the dungeons of Kithgard in this one level. I've gotten uh, 10 XP, 17 gems, and a leather belt. Let's continue. Move on. Gems in the deep. Basic syntax. We'll equip this leather belt. This thick belt balance a little extra health. Use control boss to Code combat. combat. Ah, oh, whatever. I don't even know that. Okay, but um I avoid the spice, collect the gems. Alright, so we'll so we have to get all these gems going down, then up, then over. So we'll self dot move. Down, self dot. Mm, nope. Self. Self dot move up. Self dot move up. Self dot move right. Okay, let's see. This should work. So I don't know if I said this before, but you gotta, well I guess it said it in the uh, instructions, but this, the blue things on the walls, you gotta avoid those, those are spikes. But I've completed the level. So 11 XP gained from, from uh, completing gems in the deep, and for having clean code I got 5 extra XP and 9 gems. We'll press continue. And then we have this basic syntax. Oh, these are all locked, okay. So let's keep going. Code combat. Code combat. Goals. Stay out of. Oh, I didn't read that the first time I played it. 
So the first time I played this, I just kept going straight across here. And the ogre would follow me over here and beat me to death. Uh, now I just read that, so now I know to oh, stay out of sight. So oh, don't, so don't move up, self dot move right, self dot move down, self dot move move right. We'll run this. And he should make it to the end. Wonderful success victory got 6 XP for a clean code and 10 gems, and then for completing it, and the value of not being seen. Got 11 XP and 19 gems. Almost level 4. Wonderful. Okay, well, in order to move further, I have to create an account, which I will. I plan on doing. A lot more of these videos actually because I really enjoy this game. I'm probably going to do all of the levels in all the worlds, so this is going to be a, a huge series, really. But thank you for watching one of the, my first videos, it means a lot. Leave a like, comment, I mean, subscribe if you really want to. I only have a couple of videos up. I know I personally don't subscribe when there's only a couple of videos, but I will have more content, I promise you that. This is Aberforth Cromwell, signing off.